Welcome to Ega Wellness, where our mission is disease-free life for all. Today's topic is how can I build immunity against COVID? This is on everyone's mind these days and I get that question a lot. So I thought I'll make a small video about what immunity is about. It's not uh, that you can get immunity by simply popping a pill. It comes with a disciplined lifestyle. And there are three very important pillars for immunity. The first one, which most people ignore, is sleep. And whenever I ask someone, uh, even if they get it right, uh, we, all, we hear all the time that eight hours of sleep is important for everyone. That everyone knows, but what eight hours is more important than eight hours of sleep? If you are sleeping at 12 o'clock at night and waking up at eight hours, that will be counted as day sleeping. That's probably more harmful. It is not good to sleep in the morning after sun is out. Some people are sleeping at two o'clock at night and waking up at 10 o'clock in the morning thinking that I've covered my eight hours. That is even more harmful. Our body is part of the nature around us and we have to work with nature. So when the sun is out, we have to be up before the sun is out and we have to sleep after sun sets. That is how we used to live for centuries and uh, decades. But uh, in modern day lifestyle, uh, this has changed and is one of the most important reason for a lot of health issues which are coming in. So uh, this is the most important part for good immunity. We have to wake up before sunrise and sleep by 10 p.m. because between 10 to 2 at night our body is in detoxification mode and repairs itself. If we delay our sleep then we don't get enough time for the body to repair itself. So the body is not able to uh, uh, metabolize and the immunity goes down, the aging is, must, the aging is much faster. So uh, our new cells are being formed uh, every day and old cells die and that is that this metabolism happens at night so it is very important to catch that four hours between 10 to 2 so we have to be in bed and uh, wake up early in the morning the second aspect for good immunity is food now there there is so much of information on food which food is good and bad the simple answer for this is eat freshly cooked food only you can eat almost anything as long as it is freshly cooked. That means avoid any kind of packaged food, any kind of breads, biscuits, anything which is pre-made or which is made and stored in the fridge or reheated. So this is a very, very important part. Uh, let's not complicate it too much. Freshly cooked food is better for immunity than anything. Uh, you will probably get more nutrition from a simple uh, khichdi than the best of the superfoods if it is old and reheated or coming from a package. Uh, eat uh, fresh fruits, vegetables. It's uh, the other most important part in diet is to eat only when we are hungry so that our body tells us that there is it is feeling hungry, it is ready for digesting the next meal so give at least four to five hours between your meals and we have to follow the sun again we have we are part of nature and we have to follow sun for our digestion our digestion goes with the sun uh, it is at its peak when the sun is up in the sky at 12 so the best time to eat a heavy meal is between 11 to 1 where uh, that should be our main meal of the day and we can digest whatever we eat. Early morning, it is best to start our day with uh, something which immediately nourish our, nourishes our cells and it's best to have a variety of foods and uh, have more fresh uh, vegetables or uh, fruits in the morning. Evening again is a time when we have to, uh, as the sun is going down, digestion is very weak. So we should end our uh, day with a very light meal like a soup is the best and a vegetable soup or something very light. No grains in the evening 
uh, otherwise our entire body energy at night is spent on uh, digesting our food so uh, that affects our uh, immunity so best is to eat a very light meal so that we sleep and our body focuses all its energy on uh, repairing itself and uh, rejuvenating the body the third important pillar is uh, a daily routine so ayurveda talks a lot of uh, daily routine and seasonal routine is dincharya and ritucharya so how we start our day how we end our day what time we should have fixed time for meals and uh, uh, we should change our meals with the change of season so if we are in a very hot weather nature makes a different kind of uh, fruits and vegetables around us it is best to have regional and seasonal fruits and vegetables they are the best for our nourishment and uh, we they always change with nature so nature has made very cooling fruits and vegetables which come in the summer they are uh, very good for us in the winters we get all the heating fruits which help our body to balance itself with the nature so always follow the regional and uh, seasonal fruits for best immunity ayurveda talks of uh, uh, good health as sam dosha sam agni sam dhatu sam mal kriya so means when our all the body uh, five elements of space air fire water earth are in good balance our digestive fire is working well our tissues are nourished well and the excretion is happening daily and we are cleaning our body daily we can be in good health so this is most important for our immunity uh, please uh, if you, if you like the video uh, share it and uh, like it and i will keep coming back with more videos thank you